No matter what you do, if you're an accountant, if you're a, a, po a politician, if you're a skydiver, you know, you're always going to get someone that doesn't like what you do. Hello there, my name is Kato Wraith. I'm a magician. We're in Camden Town today in North London and I'm doing some street magic. First rule of magic, you only ever do it one time, just once, never again. So, so we're going to turn this card over and it says, where does your inspiration come from? Uh, well, it, that's a real easy question for me. My, my inspiration is from my father. My father was a great uh, magician. He was a stage magician, uh, close-up magician. Uh, he did a lot of uh, escape, escapology as well. Um, that's where my real inspiration is from. Yeah, I, lo I love the old magicians as well. Uh, um, I, the, some of the new magicians, not so much. But the old, the old magicians, yes. Love order, born shit. Sorry. <laughs> I find myself ever so entertaining. The first trick my father taught me when I was six years old was the pen trick, uh, which is still my favourite trick to this day. I do it every single day here. Uh, and what you do, you basically just blow and it vanishes. My hat's right there. Uh, so yeah, I've been, I've been doing that since I was six, six years old. I'm now 45. Uh, so I've been doing it a long time, and uh, I still, I still love it. I still love it. So yeah, that, that was kind of where it started for me, being six. See, seeing my father go off to all the events with his, uh, his top hat and his cloak and his cane, and just being inspired, you know. We're gonna do it again, really slowly, okay? I love it. I love it. I, I love, I love seeing everyone's expression when they uh, see the trick. And they're like, oh, and uh, I get I get a lot of feedback from people who say that you know normally they kind of only see this thing on, like kind of on on the uh, TV, uh, and seeing it here in front of a live audience, you know, uh, people can see there's no there's there's no camera tricks, um, there's no uh, you know big props or anything. It's just me and a pack of cards. So yeah, they're kind of amazed. They're kind of like yeah, and I get I get a lot of um, compliments as well. You know, that they say that. that that must have taken years to study and stuff and where you you know to learn how to handle the cards like that and thank you thank you and uh and yeah yeah it, it, it did take a long time but worth it but worth it yep anyone you like have a look at it show it to the camera Woo! <laughs> three of spades yeah show me that's awesome hold on to it hold on to it we're gonna do it again we're gonna do it again this time put it inside for me again my friend young lady i want you that was it, I just want you. <laughs> I want you to take one card for me, okay? Hello. No. Come over, come over. One card, but it has to be the same card this young gentleman and this young gentleman took. Three of spades, take it for me, my darling. Any card you like. Have a look at it, show it to everybody. Woo! Now, what we're gonna do is this. My darling, I want you to keep your eye on your card, okay? So if we put it back right here, watch carefully. Where is it now, beautiful? It's in between. It's right on top right there, hold on to it. We're gonna do it again really slowly this time, okay? Put it in again for me. And this time I'm just gonna off jog it right there. My friend, can you push it in for me? How was it for you? Perfect, <laughs> perfect, okay. That's what I like here. If we cut it in, no it's not on top. It's not on the bottom. Where is it now, my friend? It's on the top. It is on the top, right there. Hold on to it. Woo! Young lady, hold out your hand for me. No, the clean one. <laughs> awesome, perfect. Where are you from? Spain. Awesome, awesome. I'm going to give you the ace of clubs. Hold that there. Put this hand on top for me. Fantastic. <laughs> We're going to put your three there, my darling. Now watch carefully. Tell me when you see. That's sweet. Tell me when you see the three of spades. You see it? No. no? I like this audience participation. It's on the top. It's on the top. <laughs> I like it when you say on top. Yeah. An old show, I'm sorry. No. <laughs> Actually, it is on top. It's on top right there. Turn it over, beautiful. Woo! <laughs> okay, one last thing. Hold out your lovely hand, my darling. Love? I'm going to give you all of my cards right here. Hold them nice and tight for me. What a lovely firm grip you've got, you lucky man. No. We're going to take the card right here. We're going to put it right here. Young lady, I want you to put the Cheetos down. Put the Cheetos down. Are you ready? I want you to go abracadabra. Abracadabra. That was pretty awesome. Woo! Woo! All right. All right. 
<laughs> okay, watch carefully. Thank you, my darling. The three of spades. Look out, look out, look out, look out, look out. The three of spades, thank you, goes from the top all the way through to the other side. Woo! But also. Ooh, how did you do that? That's magic. That truly is magic. Woo! Okay, now we need to change them all back. So, my darling, can you blow for me? I said blow, not spit, but that's okay. Sorry. That's okay. <laughs> we take the three away, and they all change yeah. back. Woo! Hello, beautiful. I hate when people try to pigeonhole me, and that's something I've never allowed to happen to me. Uh, when I'm not here, um, I do a lot of uh, horror shows. Uh, kind of private horror shows, and uh, I love doing stuff like that. Um, uh, you know, uh, yeah, I mean, everyone that looks different, or probably everyone in general, gets, there's always something someone else doesn't like about them. I really don't care. I really don't care what, what people say or think about me. You know, I, I, I just don't give a shit. <laughs> Appreciate it, thank you. Thank you. Have a lovely day. Thank you, thank you, my friend. Thank you, thank you, thank you, beautiful lady. If you could, uh, give one piece of advice to others who wish to follow in your footsteps or the world in general. Sure. Uh, what's, your, what's your message to the world? Be yourself, be yourself. Um, I use, uh, when, when I lived in LA, uh, I, w I, w I worked a lot and I did a lot of shows for uh, people that are transgender and um, um, in, that, in that community. And I loved it, I loved it. Because those people are so real, they're so themselves, and they don't care what anyone thinks. They just, ha they just, they're themselves. And I love that, I absolutely love that. You know, whether you're, whether you're straight, gay, bi, whatever you are, you know, uh, be yourself. And, you know, if, if kind of growing up, people say to you, you can't be a magician. You know, you've got to go and work in a factory, you've got to go and work in, a, in an office. If that's not what you want to do, you know, follow your dream. You know, you go, I, I mean, I don't get me wrong, I've been blessed. I've, I've always been able to do what I do and make a living from it, you know. Not everyone is as blessed as that. But I mean, you know, even if, even if someone had said to me now, you know, you're never gonna make another pound doing magic, I'd still do magic. I'd have, a, I'd have a, a second job on the side, but I'd still do magic, you know. So you've got to follow your dreams and you've got to be who you are, you know. You can't, you can't not be who you are. You've got, to, you've got to be who you are. Life's too short, isn't it? Am I right? I'm right, see? <laughs> wow. Thank you.